This video is for you Canon 5D Mark IV shooters who have this specific problem like I do. My camera has about 86,000 photos shot on it. Now, the problem with this is my dial on top no longer wants to rotate properly. So as I rotate this one, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't see what I mean? Well, I have an easy fix for you. I tried to contact Canon and they wanted, oh gosh, like four or 500 bucks just to fix it. And I have an easy way for you guys to do this. You require two things. You need two things. You can either get these on Amazon or you can go to Home Depot or Lowe's. I don't, not sure which one it is. It's about half price at Home Depot and Lowe's. Are, I saw this one for about 20 bucks on Amazon, or about $10, $11 at, at uh, your local store. You also need this. This is a CRC duster, dust and lint remover. You need that. This is very important. This is the magical treatment right here. QD contact cleaner, quick drying formula, leaves no residue, and plastic safe. So we're gonna have these two items and let me show you how to do this. By the way, this is very dangerous. Do not do this on your camera. Send your camera in to Canon because you can break your camera. You can make it worse. Anyways, I'm just giving you a warning. It's not my fault if you break your camera. I told you. First thing we're gonna do, turn off the camera. We're gonna take the batteries out just so there's no power going to do it. Next, we're going to take our little duster, dust and lint remover here. Give this a little spray to make sure there's nothing in there. Then what we're going to do is we're going to take this guy here and spray very, very, very little, because this does come out very quick. I'm just going to put this right in front, right over here, or right in the wheel right here, and give it one blast here. See, told you it came out quick. And I did one blast here. Okay, now we're gonna keep, it's, while it's nice and wet, what we're gonna do is we are going to rotate and rotate back and forth several times. Okay, just so it kind of settles in there, nice and gets it nice and clean. And then what we're going to do, oops, sorry for the jumpiness on the video. We're going to take our duster again, and we are going to blast out all of that stuff that we just sprayed in there. And hopefully we got it. Okay. All right. There we go. I'm going to rotate it around a little bit more. There we go. Okay. Let's do it again. All right, let's see how we look in here. Okay, I'm actually gonna let this sit for a couple of minutes and just kind of let this thing dry because I don't wanna turn the camera on quite yet. I'm sure I could, uh, everything dried up really fast, but my suggestion, let it dry for about five minutes. So I'm gonna put the camera down here and put this guy here. It's back in frame for you for reference and we'll be back in five minutes okay so five minutes has elapsed now and we are going to see if this worked yeah, let's get the batteries back in all right camera's already on and let's see if this works yes it did all right so if I saved you a bunch of money, uh, feel free to, you know, Venmo me or, or, or something like that. Um, yeah, but this is your little magical fix on how to fix your accessory button on top, okay? By the way, do this at your own peril. It's not my fault if you break your camera. This is technically not something Canon would recommend you do or uh, but this costed me less than 20 bucks to fix 
QD contact cleaner, CRC duster, and about five minutes of time, and your camera is right back to uh, right back to where it needs to be. You're just cleaning out a little bit of dust out of your uh, out of the wheel right here, and it also works on this guy right here. I actually did this first, and I was so excited it actually worked. And so I figured I'd make a YouTube video for everyone else to see. All right, well, good luck.